Hi, I'm Marissa Freeman, Chief Brand Officer of Hewlett Packard Enterprise, and I am here to talk about brand storytelling. In our business, we sell a lot of technology and everyone assumes that when you talk to a business person, the only thing they care about are the bits and bytes and performance. When we approach storytelling, we want to make sure that we're conveying the soul of the company. Hewlett and Packard are the founding fathers of Silicon Valley, and we're still very much entrenched in that community. A couple of years ago, we worked with a small agency called Something Different and created a documentary film called Seed. So our documentary film followed three hackathons and three of the teams that won and carried that story through until the very end of the story, which is at like a Shark Tank type event in Silicon Valley. The impact of this movie from a social perspective as well as a media perspective was a double win. Technology is news and the human stories around technology is what makes it so exciting. We told a story with Great Big Story about research that we are doing with a company in Germany to find a cure for Alzheimer's. And through the story, we're able to communicate how the technology and the research and our product called Memory Driven Computing is changing the way medicine will work. And it's told in such a moving and emotional way. No one is dry-eyed after watching this film. We like to think about how are we going to distribute and amplify this piece of content, this story, before we even put pen to paper. Oftentimes we are working with news outlets, The Atlantic. One story we told with The Atlantic was about the ethics of AI. If we're making the machinery, we'd better be sure that we're helping to write the rules about how to use AI safely. Together we created a short film of experts to support that important message of the ethics of AI super intelligent, really thoughtful, very entertaining, and the audience that reads that publication, they're the right people for our storytelling. If I could just implore everyone to stop thinking the old way, stop pushing ads in front of people and expecting them to behave the way you want them to, start pulling them in through their hearts and through their minds and watch how quickly your business grows.